brought to you by the Every Dollar app. Start budgeting for free today. Julian is up next in New York City. Julian, how can we help? Hi, thank you for taking my call. You so, bet. My question right now, I am around 20 years old, or I am 20 years old in college, and I'm currently making around twenty to $25,000 a month. And my boss wanted to give me a pretty big bonus for basically hitting a pretty big benchmark in, in sales, around $1.5 million. And he wanted to give me a $50,000 bonus to put towards any gift. He didn't just want to give it to me cash. And he wanted to essentially help me buy a new car. And I'm 20. I'm in college. And realistically, financially, it wouldn't make a really big dent for me to put an extra, you know, 10 to 20 into a car and potentially get like a 60 to $70,000 car. And I was wondering if it wasn't, you know, a stupid financial decision, do you think that would be potentially a good decision for me to make, you know, given that I'm, I'm 20 and it wouldn't hurt me financially. You have no debt or any debt at all? No debt, nothing. No I have 200,000 in savings. And you're making 25, 20 to 25 grand a month. Correct. And he's going to put, he's going to give you 50 towards a car and so if you buy a $50,000 car, you don't pay a nickel. If you buy a $70,000 car, you pay 20 and you've already got 200 plus in the bank. Am I hearing all this correct. right? Yes, exactly. I know it's a little bit crazy, but well, what's your what's what you, your concern? I have a concern. Well, well, let's hear his first. What's your why'd you call I, us to ask us about this? Well, I was just wondering because I think that I'm relatively mature for my age mm-hmm. and I guess going back to school, I'm taking a semester off and I'm going back to school, um, you know, in, 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 in August, in the fall. And I was just wondering, you know, g- given that I've worked so hard for the last few years, I feel that I, I deserve it and I'm excited to drive around in, in a nice car, not have to drive around in the Subaru. But I don't know, I guess other people kind of seeing that, I don't want to look like the kind of person who like my parents bought me a really nice car. You know what I mean? Even I understand what mine. you're saying. But if I'm in your shoes, I don't give a crap what anybody thinks about the car I'm driving, especially if it was a gift. And if it were me, unless I'm missing something, the guy's going to give you 50000 towards If he will not give it to you as a bonus, he's going, I'm doing it this way, then the rules right. are the rules. And you're busting it, you're killing it. Right. Unless I'm missing something. Uh, but if it were me, I wouldn't get $70,000 car. I'd get a $50,000 car and not pay a nickel. I'd take the free car. I wouldn't put any yeah. extra money into that. But let me also say, if you've been listening to this program, Dave talks about the ratio. Jade can break that down as when we talk about ratio to what you make. So for you to spend 20 on top of the 50 based That's on what fine. you make and what you've got in the bank, it's a no-brainer. So you're, if your concern is I'm worried about what others are going to say because I'm young and I'm driving a nice car around, first of all, I don't give a crap what they think. And secondly – You've got a legitimate story. You're not a trust fund baby. There's nothing for you to be ashamed of. You've worked really hard to get to this point where you're making incredible money, young man. You've been frugal. You have no debt. Uh, man, I'd say enjoy this bonus. I have a question, though. Uh, I have a couple questions. Um, you mentioned going back to school. What does that mean for your income when you go back to school? Well, surprisingly, I've actually been able to balance this pretty well with school. Yeah. Okay. Um, I just want to finish getting the, your, the the degree. I think that it's valuable, and my parents are, you know, I'm very thankful they're paying for it. So yeah, you're doing I, this I, while I mean, in school, correct? Correct. Yeah, he's yeah. making this money while okay. in school. He, when you said going back to school in August, it made it seem like you were gone for a while or hadn't yeah, well, finished. Still, I'm, I may take a bit of a pay cut, but realistically, I'll still be able to make a pretty decent uh, a pretty decent amount. Uh, yeah, yeah, you're 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 crushing it. That's crazy. <laughs> Listen, you're 20 years old. What do you, I want to know, what do you sell? What do you, can you tell us? Yeah, so I work with influencers online who have very big audiences, like anywhere from 200,000 to to a million followers online, and I okay. basically help sell and market products to those uh, to to basically their their audience, whether it's real estate or uh, make money online coaching, anything like that fitness coaching Fantastic. that's awesome and market yeah yeah that's this cool. is a no-brainer that's excellent this is a no-brainer get the car <laughs> at, hey how much are you, how much of your own money are getting are you going to add with it or are you just going to take the fifty thousand and get a fifty thousand oh, dollar car i'm thinking if i decide to get a car i'll just get the car i really want and if that ends up being 70 i'll put an extra 20 if it ends up being 50 i'll that's great. With that. Love it. Just be smart. Yeah. That's great. Just and who cares smart. what other haters think? They're drinking on that hater aid. Yeah. You, you worked hard for this. Yeah, that's fantastic. I love that story. You don't get that call very often. That's why I ask all the questions. I want to make sure I got all the facts. Well, that one's pretty straightforward. Way to go, young man.
Create your free every dollar budget today, the simplest way to budget for your life.